Hello everyone, how are you doing today? This is Stephen with Divine Mobile Home Central. We are back out at Family Dream Homes in Christmas, Florida. In today's video, we are going to be touring this gorgeous three bedroom, two bathroom, multi-section double wide home, which is by Deer Valley Homes. Now, I cannot think of the name of the actual, yeah, the Haven. It's called the Haven, so. I was lost there for a moment. So this model is called the Haven. So it's a three bedroom, two bathroom, double wide home by Deer Valley Homes. So with that being said, let's get this tour started. All right, you guys. So this is the uh, front elevation of the home. You would have a nice dormer right there. You would have your rustic uh, shutters for the windows. Get you all a good look here. Really nice exterior. And I'm not exactly sure how far back I'll be able to look at the back of the home, but we'll try. All right, so this will be the rear elevation of your home. Now, this is as far as I can get right here because you see that right there? There's a big ditch right there, so. This is about as far as I can get as far as the rear elevation of the home. Uh, feel free to pause the video if you want to get a better look at it. All right, you guys, let's get to the good stuff. Let's get this uh, walkthrough started. Let's go inside and see what the Haven has to offer. All right, so we are stepping inside. All right, so this is the inside of the home. Let's take a look at the living room first. So this is your living room. You have plenty of space in the living room. The first thing that really strikes me is the beams in the ceiling. This home has a very rustic beams in the ceiling. So now, as you can see here, you have plenty of space in this living room. Get y'all a slow pan right here. I mean, this living room is really huge, you guys. You know, it could really this this thing could really speak for itself. And you got, of course, you have plenty of space for seating right here. Plenty of seating. Get you all another scan right here. All right, so let's check out the, well, actually, you would also have uh, plenty of space right here too. So if you wanna put something additional, it's really up to you. All right, so let's check out the kitchen space. So this would be your kitchen. Now this is kind of open, but it's also kind of separate. You know what, if I would never have paid attention, I wouldn't have noticed. But as you can see right here, you would have a big rectangle right here. It separates the, uh, the spaces are together, but yet they are separate. So it's kind of a semi, semi open concept, but not exactly. So I like that. All right, so you have your uh, center island right here. Beautiful center island. You have your uh, recess lights or pendant lights in the or can lights in the ceiling. You have this really nice uh, butcher countertop. Of course, you have a glass of wine right there. Anybody wants a glass of wine? <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. But anyway, uh, 
Uh, let's see. You always have to have a little comedy in these videos, you guys. So. But anyway, you have that, and as well as this really nice butcher countertop. You would have your uh, stainless steel sink. Of course, you have a, a faucet. And you'll also have some free cupcakes right there. More free cupcakes. Now, if you didn't see the cupcakes in the previous model that I've toured, which was the Summit by Fleetwood Homes, that's the video right before this one. I'll put a link up in the iCard above if you want to go check out that home tour. Very nice home. All right. Okay, so you would have your dishwasher right here. Frigid air. I know it's not about appliances, but you know, I always like to get, um, take a look. Let's take a look behind us. You have your microwave, you also have your stove, and as well as your stainless steel refrigerator. And this is one, this is probably my um, second Deer Valley home that I've ever toured on this channel. The only other Deer Valley home that I've ever toured was the Amen. It was at this very location about a year and a half ago. But if you want to go watch the Amen tour, I'll put the link up in the iCard above if you want to check that out as well. But one thing I noticed about Deer Valley, they're, they are very well known for this type of um, archway above the stove and the microwave area. Very, very, very uh, distinctive. And then, of course, you have plenty of space for decorations in the core. Let's take a look at a couple of cabinet spaces. I know you guys like it when I open the cabinets. So, of course, that's soft close, and that's also soft close. Got plenty of space up here. You have your drawer space. Of course, your microwave. And as well as this additional cabinet space. And hey, you have some slow cooker recipe book right here if you if you wanna, you know, take a look at that. <laughs> Anyway, um, and more additional cabinet space. And then, of course, you have your refrigerator. And then you'll have the recessed lights above that. You now, people will sit right here at the bar where you're, while you're preparing a nice um, meal. And over here behind that, you would have additional cabinet space. You got plenty of counter space right here. Don't worry about that stuff right there. That's my stuff right there. It's my drink. And, you know, got to stay hydrated while I'm doing these tours. Um, you have your, they give you a really general idea of how you can decorate it. And, of course, you got additional drawer space as well. And see, they're soft closed. And more counters, cabinet space. All right, so we spent enough time in the kitchen. We got this. We got more house to look at. So let's take a look at the dining room and the utility room. So this would be your dining room space, you guys. I love the fact that they have the two windows right here. It lets in lots of natural light in the daytime. Of course, they would have a very nice chandelier. You would have your back door right there. And you also have your air vents in the ceiling throughout the home. All right, so here's your utility room. This will be your utility room. Have plenty of space in this utility room. You have your washer and dryer hookup right here. Eh, probably no space for a freezer, but if you have like a little small freezer, I, I imagine that you could probably maybe put it right there. It's really up to you, though. Depends on if, if you really need a freezer. Depends on what your needs are. So, And right here, you would have a space. 
this space right here be your for your central heat and air. So when your home is connected and everything, your central heat and air conditioning will be right here in this uh, closet area. And I can tell this is for a central heat and air because it'll have the air grill right there, the return grill. And of course, if you don't want to look at this space, all you have to do is shut the door. Very, very simple. All right, so let's go check out the rest of the space. All right, so we're going to start with these two bedrooms. And we'll check out the guest bathroom and then the master. So this will be your first guest bedroom. You've got plenty of space in this room. I really love the uh, one the first one thing that I definitely noticed when I walked into this house. It has wood vinyl flooring, no carpet in this house, you guys. And it also has a full tape and te textured sheetrock walls too. So let's get you all a view from another angle here. All right, so here's your closet space. Get y'all a quick look at the closet. Give you a general idea. All right, so let's go check out the next room. All right, so this will be the next guest bedroom. It's guest bedroom number two. Let's check out the closet here. Now this closet would have three shelves. I see three shelves. Well, no, two shelves, I'm sorry. But still plenty of shelving though. You can put your put your shirts right here. You can put your shoes right there. You can put more shoes down there, and then you can hang your pants or dresses right or skirts right there. So very nice. Okay, one more good look. And then we'll check out the guest bathroom. Let's check out the guest bathroom. So this will be your hallway guest bathroom. Plenty of space in this guest bathroom. You have your mirror right there and as well as your sink. You would also would have your commode. Let's take a look at the tub and shower combo. One thing I really like about this, look at this. You don't see this in many manufactured homes. I like the fact that this uh, shower curtain, it kind of swivels out. It swivels um, outward. So it really gives you more space in the shower. So I like that. And I like the fact that it's, it, it matches the hardware throughout the rest of the house, too. All right. So this is your uh, garden tub shower combo because this is definitely in shape of a garden tub. Not sure how well you can see that. Let me get my flashlight. There we go. Can you guys see? All right. So this is your garden tub shower combo. And again, the hardware matches the rest of the hardware in the house. Now, the shower is very easy to maintain and keep clean. Okay. And, of course, up there, you would have a recessed light, too, above the shower and tub area, which is, which is an awesome feature. All right. So let's go check out the master bedroom. But before we do that, and if you are new here, uh, I invite you to hit that subscribe button. I do manufactured, in-person, manufactured modular home tour videos like you're seeing today. And I also do virtual 360 walkthrough tours and as well as general information videos concerning manufactured and modular homes. If all that interests you, definitely subscribe to our channel. Welcome. We are very happy to have you here. And for anyone that's watching this video, if you like what you see today, 
uh, definitely give it a big thumbs up. It will definitely help with the algorithm of this channel. And I really appreciate it. Again, thank you. Now, before we go to the master, I almost forgot to point something out. Look, you would have your linen cabinet right here. Right here beside the bathroom, you would have the linen cabinet. We'll get you all a general idea. Okay. And look, they are soft closed cabinets. Very, very nice. All right, let's go check out the master bedroom right here. And the master bedroom be right off the living room over here. We turn you guys around slowly. And you would also have your air conditioning thermostat right there by the master. All right, so this is your master bedroom. I like how they have it set up right here. They, ha they have it set up in the perfect spot. You have your bed right there, and you'd have the two lamps and the nightstands on either side. And as you also know, notice throughout the home, it has a textured ceilings too. So let's get you all a view from another angle. All right, let's check out the master closet. So this is your master closet. Let me get my flasher, because I know it's a little dark in here, so. All right. Not the largest master closet I've seen in a manufacturing home, but this is a very, very nice size. It will definitely work for someone out there. And you got plenty of shelving space here too. I'll probably take like an extra uh, bottom shelf right there and, and probably put it, won't put an extra shelving right there. At least that's what I would do. Okay, very nice size uh, master closet. Let's take a look at the master bathroom. So check out the master bath. Now, as you would notice right here, it would have the, uh, sliding door the barn sliding door right here but you know if you don't like the if you don't like the barn sliding door you can always opt to get a, a standard a standard door like this one it's really up to you so definitely keep that in mind all right so this is your master bathroom okay now it doesn't have a, a garden tub but it does have a huge walk-in shower all right You have your cabinet space right here. Okay. Get you all a look. Okay. You have your window right there, let some natural light. You also have your commode tuck over there in the corner. All right, let's turn around here. All right, so you have your walk in shower. Look at this walk in shower. Now it's a little dark, so I'm gonna try to get you all let it, let y'all see it better here. So you got tile, you got tile, all tile shower. Look, they got tile on the floor, and this is where you step in. You have your uh, shower knob right there, and guys, this this right here is hand laid tile. Look at that hand laid tile right there. This whole shower is hand laid tile. All right, you have a bench over there. You would have your Rainmaker shower head and as well as a recessed light. And you would also have another shower head right there too that, that you can hold in your hands. And you also have a glass window insert right there built in. That's very nice, I like that. Very, very custom shower. Okay, let's take a look over here. And right here, you would have your sink. 
Now it does have one sink. I'm not sure if you can get two sinks. Now if you get two sinks, you'll probably be sacrificing the space for the drawers right here. But right here you have your drawer space. No. But personally, I would I'll be just as happy with one sink. This will work for me just fine. And of course, you would have your mirror in as well as the vanity lighting. Overall, this is a very nice manufactured home by Deer Valley. All right, you guys. So let's 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 talk about the pricing, and then we'll close out the video. All right, you guys. So this home was called the Haven by Deer Valley Homes, which is a three-bedroom, two-bathroom, multi-section double wide. Now, this home has also been sold according to their um, paper right here. But this home, the the estimated price was listed at one hundred ninety-nine thousand dollars. $199,000. Now, I'm not sure if that was included with um, setup or AC or skirting or, or you know, any other specifications. You would have to contact this dealership about more information concerning that matter. So, again, all the information that I have will be down in the description box for this home. Again, you guys, I do not work for the dealership or the manufacturer of this home. I tour these homes because I love and enjoy touring these homes. And I love sharing all the homes that I view with each and every one of you. So if you are really interested about the homes that they have here, you would have to reach out to the people here at Family Dream Homes in Christmas, Florida. They'll be more than happy to answer any questions that you may have. All right, you guys. Well, it's time to move on to the next house. So we're going to go ahead and end this video right here. So this is Steven with the Vine Mobile Home Central, your central source for manufactured modular home tours and more. I will see you all in the next video. Y'all take care and have a wonderful day.